Fred Hammond. And that number song, number 28, mm -hmm. yes, that is fire. Yes, tell me where it hurts, you know. I'm not sure what's going on because I know Fred told us both to his, our faces that he was going independent. So guess what? The what? record label releases this album. I mean, what does that mean? Maybe. <laughs> his old label. Maybe he was saying independent in terms of his inner man. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> but this is what yeah. they do when right. you leave them. They say, well, hey, we still own this music, and we're going to put it out. Hello. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Ain't yeah. nothing wrong with it. You know? Maybe he yeah. should be like Prince and put a slave on the side of his face. I don't know. Oh, my goodness. That's controversial, you know. That's yeah. All right. Everybody hates the record labels, but everybody wants a deal. Okay. <laughs> now, the, the big story is what? the Stellar nominees came out Tuesday. I know. And as always, I was right again. I know. Um, Ja'Kalen Carr. Now, here's Artist of the Year. Now, Brian Courtney Wilson is not in this one, which what? I believe he should be. Uh, Ja'Kalen well, yeah. Carr, Jonathan McReynolds, Miranda Curtis, and Todd Delaney. Now, you said that it was going to be the year of Miranda, Miranda Curtis, Curtis and Brian, Brian Courtney Wilson. Wilson. But apparently, it's going to be Jonathan McReynolds. Oh, really? He's got way more nominations. Okay. Now, well, Brian Courtney this? Wilson does have some. Yes. Uh -huh. Yeah. And he's had a great year, but... Um, I guess, you know, it, go, it goes by the, the second round of voting was very steep. It really was. Oh, really? Uh, thousands and thousands of people voted, and here you go. This is what we end up with, which is cool. I mean, these are all great artists. They all had great years. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, for Song of the Year, Nobody Like You, Lord, Miranda Curtis. Uh-huh. Not Lucky I'm Love, Jonathan McReynolds. Yes. Won't he do it? Come on, that's the one. I'm <laughs> that's sorry. the one. Uh, you Know My Name, Tasha Cobbs, which... I don't know how that got in there. I don't know how that got in there See. either because people like Tasha Cobbs. But if you're going to pick a song by Tasha Cobbs, why not pick the one that's been in the countdown going on now two years? Right. But, you know. They didn't they, want to because of Nicki Minaj to. probably. Oh, you know what? Probably. Probably. <laughs> probably. 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 You know, we're going to talk about, be talking about this stellar yeah. awards all throughout the show. Yes. But you don't want to miss what we got coming up next. What's mm -hmm. up next, Nina? What's coming up next is more great gospel music, and these are the best of the best of the best. Mm -hmm. We got number 27 from Israel Holton and Travis Green. It's called Promise Keeper. It's the Blazing High Praise, Top 40 Countdown. Get ready. <laughs> we can go three minutes. We're good, because I took, I took two songs out. Okay. <coughs> Why well, are you coughing? I, I was just.